Wait. Tending Bridget's Flame awakened to the Celtic goddess of hearth, temple, and forge by Nia. Um, Weatherstone. It's likely really simple to say, but I'm totally screwing it over. But yeah. Um, new book from Llewellyn. Um, so, as I've said before, my usual. So I'll post it this up. Um, like to me, um, all of the information is worthwhile reading. Um, she does have other um, people. Oh, if you're um, if you get like Circle um, Circle Sanctuary magazine, I'm like hundred percent sure that this was in a recent it, um, issue of it. But anyway, um, so um, she has uh, con contributors to the book. So um, one being Jonah Powell Colbert. Um, so she has a list at the um, end. Um, so. Um, uh, so me, speaking of Circle Sanctuary, um, Sina Fox, um, sorry, is one of, um, the people that wrote, um, in here. Um, Lisa Steele, um, like, she, I got, I purchased, um, like, the Circle of the Seasons. Um, CD off of iTunes and um, her inbox song was is um, of Bridget. So um, yeah, there's that and then. But anyway, um, talks about the door and the threshold. Um, So she um, talked about like how Bridget's the source of the flame, welcoming like her, um, Earth, um, welcoming the flame. It's like divided into certain categories that she is um, encompassing. So got there, the temple, the devotional flame, um, the forge, the transforming flame. And like how to tend your own flame, um, how to encompass her, and how um, Bridget, like, um, she's been a goddess and like a saint, um, pretty much like, um, she's been worshipped on pretty like uninterrupted for thousands of years. Because um, if you think like um, like me. Roman and Greek gods and goddesses, or Egyptians, um, there may have been like some, correct me if I'm wrong, there may have been some interruption of which god or goddess has been um, worshipped, but she's saying, you no, know, from the moment um, people have spoken about her, um, there has been like this uninterrupted um um worship of her um and like there's one this one um belief because like if you read there's multiple viewpoints of her and that she, and like one thing is like she was with mary when mary burst out jesus so there's that um but there is that few, there is these stories that um, um, she was in their time and still continues. And it all, there are a few different viewpoints of how she came to be. But yeah, um, there's that um, shrine and altar. Um, 
your kitchen or hearth, your garden. So how to bring her into that. Um, there's, she's like, there's um, crumbly, crumble recipe. Um, Bridges broom, mindful house cleaning. So these like small rituals like with food and house cleaning, how to bring her in. And um, one of the other things I've posted is um, candles. Um, like I, um, ever since like May, um, this May one, I've started, whether it's for like an hour or several hours, I have a candle lit. So there, um, that's like me bringing her in and then like my, um, clear, like, spiritual moment is when I light that candle and when I have it and I know it's there. Um, it does talk about her Celtic kin, like, um, so Morgan, um, Fab, Fab, and Naaman, uh, Nero, Folda, and Banba. Um, it talks about a few other um, goddesses and how she, um, how people relate to her and um, and then other goddesses of like healing, spring, the craft, um, a craft. So um, yeah, on page seventy two is when she's talking about Mary. Um, so, how she relates to other, um, goddesses, um, you, you do get the, um, she has a, um, she's a practitioner of goddess spirituality, so there is that more focus on the feminine. Um, female goddess um, aspect of the book. So there's um, Celtic goddess, spirit, Celtic and goddess spirit, spirituality. Either one or both are um, intriguing to you. Um, worth a look at. Um, she doesn't talk about um, how Bridget is related to all the seasons. Um, earthly allies. Um, I posted um, the swan because um, a king that I like, King Ludwig, you've seen the playlist for um, my books about him, um, in like folklore um, of Bavaria and like the tales, the swan, the swan knight and the swan um, as an animal are prominent in features that he um, that he likes. So, and the fact that there were swans in his um, in the pond of his like summer um, in one of the castles he's gone in the castle he went to as a child, there were swans and got into nature, but there's that. Um, so these different animals. Um, I've also posted it. Um, there's, she goes into a few different stones and she then goes into places, but I um, posted treen for like courage. But there's um, a few other um, ones there. So, um, flame keeping time and timelessness. So, talking, um, uh, like, new and full moon, um, like on the Sabbath. Um, so, candles, oil, um, 
he does talk about um, flameless candles and um, matches for use with lighters. Um, like she's more preferring matches because they have a limited time frame. Um, to me, with flameless candles, um, if you aren't too big on having actual candle, I know you can't really, the way it's burning, can't really see it, but, um, it's, like, I have this tea light. To me, um, if you have the same connection as a battery operated, because even the battery has a time limit on it, but you can say that's the same thing for lighters, but, um, both, if you have the same intention, to me, it can still be um, the same as that. Um, throughout the book, she talks about like the craft, like crafts, home, their hearth, um, forge, and how she represents that and that um, Bridget is part of us, um, no matter what kind of like craft we do. Um, so, uh, um, and like something that I like, she has, um, I'm starting on 192, um, Bridget and Excellence, that, um, our best is, shouldn't really, um, Um, like, in some situations, the best we could do is true, so, there's that, um, so, um, so, just 19 flames for Bridget, um, Um, you offer a prayer each night or do it 12 days of Christmas style. On the first night, offer flame once prayer. On the second night, offer prayers for one and two, and so on. So, um, it goes on like that. So, if you're, I did not expect it to go for this long, but, um, if you like Bridget, um, Celtic, um, Goddess, Spirituality, um, God-centered, um, or, um, um, symbolism of, like, fire in, um, like, your home or what you do, what you craft, um, this is a book to look into, um, Uh, yeah, <laughs> and um, if you're just looking in, um, wanting to look into, um, look, learn about goddesses, or if you want to learn more about Bridget, um, this is something to look into. You do you get that first person kind of like she's talking to. So, it's not like a textbook, here are the facts, um, like I've been used to the past four, um, four years of, um, university, so, um, yeah. Sending Bridget's Flame, it is worth looking into, um, if anything surrounding her interests you. Happy readings!